Hello, my name is Miguel La Madrid, and today I wanted to show you, um, share the article that I use for my news presentation three, and that is of the um, the lady who accused Emmett Till, which then led to him getting killed. Uh, she passed away uh, earlier this week, and it was a very um strange kind of reactions of many people. Um, I think there were way more people who felt relief and happiness i could say in a way because they she was a terrible woman who did a terrible thing whose her actions led to a young boy being lynched and killed if no one knows too much about the story is this lady white lady um lied to a group of white men saying that emmett till was making inappropriate um advances to her and bothering her and obviously this is a time of racism and segregation and just so anything a, a black male would do, um, they were in trouble, right? So this happened, and then um, the white men, they lynch um, Emmett Till, and they kill him. And from then, this was a big event where in this civil rights movement era, because you know, you learn about it in schools and it was just a turning point because it, it showed the, the magnitude of what racism was getting to. Right. Um, and until sadly, he became a figure in civil rights movement, but because of his death, he um, his mother chose to have an open casket because she wanted the world to see what they've done to her boy, what racism was promoting, what racism was causing. And I think altogether, it was just such a powerful um just a movement afterwards about that because I feel like the black community united because of this death, kind of how you see in today's, in our recent history, you know, in 2020 when George Floyd was killed by the police, it was kind of the same because it kind of united the black community and just people all around who cared and wanted to support. And I just feel like it was a great article to um, do my presentation on. Um, and yeah, um, my lady, she finally died. Um, hopefully she had some regret for what she did if she didn't then i mean that's just the world they lived in and now we're trying to make a, a better world for ourselves thank you